Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. In today's video, I will show you guys my top 10 Cydia tweaks for my iOS device, uh, which happens to be an iPhone 5. Now, I'm not going to go into the details of all these tweaks because that will just waste your time. I will give you the name and price of each tweak, and all you have to do is go to Cydia, search for the tweak, and install it. Uh, to change the settings of each tweak, you just go to the regular settings menu. And uh, just so you know, 8 out of 10 of these awesome tweaks are free. So let's get started by number 1. Okay, so the first one is Unfold, which is free. Um, it lets you change your unlock screen and it replaces the Swipe to Unlock with Fold to Unlock. You get a matching folding animation as you unlock your device using your finger. You can also change the text that usually says swipe to unlock to anything you desire. So I changed mine simply to unlock but you can have your name, your surname, your mother's name, whatever you desire. Number two is called Torch also free lets you add a nifty looking little lightning symbol that you can tap to turn your iPhone's flashlight on and off. Uh, perfect for when you are in a dark area and you need a quick peek around maybe to find a keyhole or something so this is free again and it's really good number three Zeppelin lets you change the carrier icon on the top left side of your iPhone uh, Zeppelin comes in with over 10 built-in icons that you can just throw up there including icons like two different Batman icons Android icon Apple icon and such random flip tweak adds a very pleasant effect to your iOS device. It just makes icons on your home screen randomly flip. It's eye candy and it brings some life to the static interface of the iOS. Love it. At number five we have iWidgets which lets you add widgets to your home screen. You get two widgets with your first install, the calendar and the clock widget that look really nice. You can download more widgets from Cydia for the iWidget tweak. Another tweak is called the NC settings. It lets you add a toggle widget to your notifications bar. It has access to most frequently used settings such as Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, lock rotation, location services, mute and such. You even get a little toggle switch to quickly let you turn your LED flash on and off so you can use it as a flashlight if necessary. Uh, you can always go to the settings of this tweak and remove or add whatever toggle uh, you want or don't want. Next is OXO. The OXO replaces the native iOS switcher at the bottom of your iPhone screen. You can now see full previews of your running apps and you can simply swipe down to terminate an app. Additionally, you can also remove all the apps at once. You do this by tapping and holding in the app switcher area and when prompted just say yes. Swipe to the left and you will get access to the audio controls with a refined interface. Uh, where you can change the previous or next track and control the volume. One more swipe to the left, one more swipe to the left and you get a really awesome quick settings toggle interface. From here you have access to 12 settings that you can change at the press of a button of a tap as well as a dedicated slide bar to change your brightness. Okay at number eight we have AppSent which is free so when you download an app on your home screen it changes the regular download bar to a numbered percentage bar so you can just see the progress in, in, um, in terms of numbers. Hooks Law adds a springy animation to all iOS animations. You will see a little spring effect every time you launch or exit an app as you can observe in this video. Uh, additionally you can speed up these animations to a level where you can load apps at lightning speed now the app itself won't actually load at lightning speed but the animation of the launch will speed up as you can observe you can tweak the speed values by going to the settings under hooks law uh, to speed up or slow down these animation effects I left the best for the last it's called barrel it's two dollars and ninety nine cents it adds a graphical effect as you scroll through your home screen uh, you get to choose from 18 different animation styles all of them are unique and pleasant 
one of the features I'm really enjoying is that you can also choose to randomize these effects as you scroll through your screen. Uh, truly adds, adds uh, some life to the iOS experience and I highly recommend paying for it. And this brings us to the end of the tweaks video. I will try to create uh, some more videos with more tweaks very soon. Hopefully you enjoyed these until then. Remember, to get these tweaks, just go to Cydia, search for the tweak by name, and install it. You can then configure them from the settings menu. All right. Uh, well, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come and give me a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, just put them down in the comments section below. Thanks.